Kia ora e hoa, haere mai. Do you like playing music? Maybe you like listening to music or dancing to music. Well, I'm learning to play music on an instrument. And this book is all about some very cool musical instruments and somebody who would like to play one. It's called Jungle Jazz. It's written by Joe Van Dam and illustrated by Deborah Hind. Are you nice and comfy, ready for a musical story? Well, let's begin. It's just not fair, Snake hissed. He was hiding in the rocks listening to the dung beetles practice. The band was having so much fun and Snake was very, very jealous. Snake really wanted to be a part of the band, but he couldn't do what the other animals could do. Here's Snake down here. And here are all the other animals. Cougar was slapping and tapping the congas. Howler Monkey was on lead guitar and vocals. Armadillo played bass, while Bear blew smooth sounds on her saxophone. The hummingbirds were doing what they do best. Humming. Hum. Humming as they fly around. After the band left, Snake slithered over to the congas. He stared at them sadly. I can't sing along to a tune or a song. I can't even hum or bang on a drum. Snake glided across to the guitars. I don't have a thumb. I can't thrum or strum. I can't pluck a string on anything. He slid over to the saxophone. I can't pucker my lips, the mouthpiece just slips. If I could blow a note, it would sound like a goat. It was the same the next night, and the night after that, and the night after that. The dung beetles jazzing and jiving and having a ball, and snake sulking under a rock. Finally, he could stand it no more. After the animals went home that night, Snake slithered over to the instruments. What's he going to do? When the band met the following evening, they could not believe their eyes. No microphone, no guitars, no saxophone. Just one slightly slimy set of congas sitting there. What could have happened to their instruments? Hmm. From where Snake was hiding came a guilty <sighs> Armadillo trotted to the rocks to investigate. It wasn't me. I didn't do it, hissed Snake. Armadillo frowned. What wasn't you? What didn't you do? Come out, Snake. We need to talk. What did Snake do? <laughs> Snake slid rather bumpily from his hiding place. The animals gasped. It was you, they cried. What were you thinking, Snake, said Bear. Howl a monkey howled, and the hummingbirds hummed angrily. Hmm. Can you see what Snake did? <laughs> Where are the instruments? Inside Snake. Yes. I just wanted to be a part of the band, cried Snake. I can't play an instrument because I have no hands and my lips won't pucker. My hums come out as hisses and it's just not fair. I swallowed all your instruments so you couldn't play either. What about my congas? asked Cougar. 
I tried and tried, but I just couldn't open my mouth that wide. I'm sorry, said Snake, as tears trickled down his scaly skin. Oh, look at Snake. And look at the guitars inside Snake. The other animals looked at Snake, then at each other, then burst out laughing. Snake looked totally ridiculous. Give us back our instruments and we'll have a think, Armadillo said. Snake regurgitated the instruments one by one. Here comes one guitar. And this guitar is next. They were a bit sticky and a bit slimy, but otherwise fine. Cougar started to smile. You know, Snake, you do have an instrument you can play, and you've had it all along. From that night on, the dung beetles were even better than before. Can you see Snake playing? I'll show you on this page. I can't sing or strum or blow or drum, but I can rattle my bum and it's fun, fun, fun. <laughs> snake was a rattlesnake. And it's like having a shaker. And Snake proudly shook his own rattlesnake maraca tail. And that's the end of the story. But guess what's in the back of the book? A game of snakes and ladders. You just need to add a dice and some playing pieces like buttons or pebbles. How cool is that? Well, if you'd like to find out more about this book, you can visit picturebook.co.nz. What a funny story. Imagine a snake swallowing the instruments so nobody else could play them. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? Well, come and visit me again soon, my friend. I love reading stories with you. Ta kite. I'll see you soon.